Also, you did a great job. This is one of the best fields of maximum I've seen this year. Yes, it's really done well. You know, this is a great example of what a food plot is and how a food plot can perform on your property. This is a three acre field and we planted the whole thing in maximum and we planted this about the first of September and yeah. it actually didn't get any rain till about mid-September. So this is mid-September to the first of December of growth that we're looking at. That's right. And what's important to note is that a food plot, you know, it can enhance the, the and attract wildlife from your neighbor's property to yours. So food plots are great as a as a destination field if you're, you're going to hunt or you just want to observe wildlife but a food plot's really important whether you're in the south or the midwest or the northeast these green food plots that you plant in the fall and these are annuals are super super attractive and what's impressive to me is the amount of tonnage that we've been able to grow in just a few short months i mean there's literally probably eight to ten tons of forage per acre not only green forage but look at the tubers that are growing that the deer are eating as well lots of good carbohydrates right there that'll carry them through those rough rough winter months. You know, a lot of the guys in the Midwest say, well, why do I need to plant a food plot if I'm in Iowa? The whole state's a food plot. But after they harvest their soybeans or their corn, um, you know, go back into the, the corners of these fields, the, the little small places tucked away, and plant something like Maximum. You can attract a lot of deer. The gr this stuff will stay green fall, winter, and into the spring. And as evidenced by all the stems you see, um, there's a lot of grocers out here. Now, Biologic Maximum are brassicas, which are some of your favorite plants, I know. They really are. And there's a real high leaf to stem ratio. They're very digestible. Why don't you eat one of these leaves for folks just to prove how palatable that they are? I've already had my field today. <sighs> Work with me, Austin. I'm trying to, trying to do something here. But brassicas, the brassicas that Biologic use, the brassicas that are in Maximum, in Premium Perennial, in, in the Green Patch Plus, they're super productive. If you planted a field of just winter wheat, you know, you, you might get you a ton per anything. acre, but Maybe. 10 tons per acre, that's a lot of groceries. And the secret, the secret to making this look like this is we overwhelm the deer. This is a three acre field, which isn't a giant field by any stretch. But when you, when you do really small fields like quarter acre fields, that's when we see the deer just consume them down and, and they're lip, lip high. But a larger field like this, there's a lot of groceries here and it takes them a while to eat it, eat it all. This is gonna feed these deer all the way through up into February. Yeah, and they'll be eating these bulbs. That'll be the last thing that they consume.